All right, guys, so welcome back. You know, we've been playing horror games for about a week, nonstop, literally like every single day, there has been a horror game to some sort of extent. And quite honestly, I'm getting sick and tired of it. We're gonna take a little bit of a break, maybe a couple of weeks or maybe not, maybe less. So we're gonna end it off with this nice short horror game that I found that is in a VHS format. And it just looks flat out terrifying. Probably it sucks. Probably it's great. But I guess there's only one thing to do, and that's find out. So sit back, relax, and let's do this. It's a countryside 1999. One construction worker quit his job after encountering what he believed was a strange creature. An old Victorian house has been sitting vacant for years, so crews came in to begin demolishing it to make way for a new building. However, it wasn't long after the demolition started that one of the crewmen spotted a strange creature inside of the building. Hmm. Wow. Oh, this is spooky, dude. Man, sometimes it's one thing to look at, like, images of a game, and another thing is to flat out play it. Take a look at this, um, at the flashlight. Oh my god. Well, there's a reason this game is short, and when I mean short, I, I honestly don't think you guys have any clue how short this is. It's like eight minutes long. Over the last couple of horror games, we've been playing hour and a half sessions, two hour plus sessions. The Caregiver, that was a long one, and quite frankly, I am uh, mentally exhausted at this point. By the way, it's October 26, 1999, at around 12, 16 a.m., and I would only do some shit like this in video games. Bro, the camera rotation is wild. It's like you rotate and the flashlight goes before. It's definitely strange. Okay, before we go inside the house, we're gonna go here and investigate the outer perimeter of this property. Okay, this probably belongs to my crew. We've been trying to demolish his property here to obviously build something new. All right, what do we have here? the fuck was that? I don't even know how to interact with things. I think the, the game said that you have to like use right mouse click or something for certain texts. I'm not sure. I'm just here for the ride. In case you didn't know right now, my headphones are fully blasting. I told myself if it's gonna be short, we, we, we better make it count. I don't expect anything too crazy to be honest. I think the atmosphere alone and the way this game plays is worth, it's worth a video. Okay, here's the text. Red text. The last person alive hears knocking. The door's open. Oh my god. Hello? Is there anybody in there? Oh my god. Thank god this game is no longer than 10 minutes. Fuck that. Oh my- Man, they gotta make like a full game out of this thing. This is crazy. Got a little cockatoo. Cockatoo. Okay, what am I saying? Built in 1937, Aaron Finch. Or... Avon Finch. Ah! I just heard footsteps. <gasps> what the fuck? Oh my god. Guys, please put on headphones. Don't be a little chicken shit. You need to put on headphones. It doesn't count if you're not watching this with headphones. Hello? Somebody left their walker here. Can I go inside that room? It doesn't appear like I can. Got some nice decoration. Listen here, Gramps. I like what you've done with the place. Good old tennis balls at the end of the walker. Make it easy for sliding. <laughs> Anybody behind me? Bro, this flashlight animation is driving me insane. Now let me ask you, why do we have to come inside this property? Why can't we- There's blood on the freaking door and it's pretty recent. Why can't we just knock this shit down? And so be it. Hell. <laughs> With a smiley face. Man, it's 1999. Emojis weren't even a thing. Gotta hold down the right stick. You got a red pencil there. So the, the way you progress further in this game is by finding red texts on the, what is that? On the walls. And then something happens like tick. God, I can't fucking stand that. All right, let's go. That's it, bro. Snap out of it. This is a freaking video game. Come on, man. It's nothing's gonna happen. The most that's gonna happen is possibly just a little jump scare, a little shitty jump scare, and everything will be okay. This room is now opened. 
Uh, just saw... Wait, what? Okay, this is the outdoors. Not half bad. Just saw my reflection blink. I honestly cannot believe this game is this short. Like... <sighs> Fuck. Ooh. Mm, man, the sound effects are gnarly. Should I go back there? I know there was like... Uh, the end of the, the hallway was barricaded. What the fuck is that? Oh my god. Okay, I think we're in the clear. <laughs> we got somebody singing now. This is just great. Absolutely phenomenal. There's only been like one or two games that I've played that have done the flashlight animation so good. And this is definitely one of them. It's like the, the flashlight moves and then the camera moves like slightly after. And it's so good. Okay, should I go back to the tractor? Maybe to the main entrance? I read what somebody said that this game was only eight minutes long. And for some reason, I've been recording for about 15, 20 minutes. Maybe I'm just taking my sweet time with it. But this is now open. And I think uh, shit's about to hit the fan. There will be blood. <laughs> okay, well, here we go. Nothing happened. That's very suspicious. This is definitely possibly one of the scariest short games that I've played. And it's not even over yet. <laughs> Are we going back inside? Don't know where I'm going. And back inside the house we go. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh. My fucking throat hurts right now. He explored all the hallways and there were a lot of hallways. Some of them didn't have temporary lighting installed, so they were pitch black. All of a sudden, his ears began ringing, just like mine. The sound and pitch got louder and louder, uh, louder and louder until it was unbearable. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm, I can't even fucking read right now. He dropped to his knees, grabbing his ears and crying out in pain and crying out in pain and pain and pain. I knew that there was gonna be a jump scare. Like, I just felt it. I felt it. I've seen games like this before. I guess it just boils down to, I'm just an idiot. I've played so many horror games now throughout the years on this channel, and it's just, it doesn't get any easier. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. I'm happy it's over. Dare I say a game like this, more than 30 minutes would be almost unplayable because that shit is the, the mechanics the atmosphere, that is ridiculous. Honestly ridiculous. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. Of course, if you did, drop me a like. Would really appreciate it. Help Helps out the channel, obviously. And uh, just lets me know you guys are liking what you're seeing. So thanks again. I'll catch you later.